This is footage, an uh, eight millimeter fillet footage, which was filmed in a little box device of David Susskind's first nationally broadcast program in which the subject of homosexuality was discussed. On screen right now is Randolph Wicker, that's me. Uh, it's the mid 1960s, I think 60. Six or 67, maybe 65. That's Dick Leitch, who's from the Mattachine Society. He was the, the guest and spokesperson for the gay community at that time. In this first nationally broadcast television program, and they had on a guest who I believe was named Hatterer, whose contention was that all homosexuals were sick, as David Susskind on the left. That's apparently Dr. Hatterer sitting there. There were various luminaries in the audience uh, that were figures in the movement, which you'll see in a few moments. And that's Peter Ogren. That's Peter Ogren right now who's speaking. He was my lover from 1964 to 1972. And he spoke from the dock, as I did. And he was quite annoyed at the psychiatrist because they had ventured that I and everyone else, but somehow they must have specifically mentioned me at some point, said that I was mentally ill for being a homosexual. Got very offended at that. At one point, raised his hand and said, "You have to say that my lover is sick, and you've never even spoken to him. You have incredible." And he was as furious. He raised his hand, and he reached for a word, and the word turned out to be hubris, which David Susskind said after the show. That means arrogant pride. I will make a better copy of this. This, as I said, is filmed off of a screen in a little box. And I'm going to have it transcribed so it doesn't flicker and it's a much better image. But it is the only visual image that I know surviving of the first nationally broadcast program of homosexuality. And I and The screen fades in and out. This is just what happens when you have 8mm footage or film from so many years ago. That is the uh, 